Hello from Blues Domino. Been a while since I've had a little bit of a video for you. Just wanted to say hello to all you fellow guitar nerds out there. Uh, sure do enjoy playing the blues and just uh, guitar in general. And I uh, wanted to give you a little shout out to say hello and thank you for subscribing to this channel and keeping in touch by taking a look at the videos. Sure do uh, enjoy it and hope you do as well. Uh, just wanted to let you know that uh, Blues Domino used his little ingenuity and uh, put together a little pedal board. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and give you a little video of that. All right, here's my pedal board. I took the just a piece of scrap wood. It was originally the base for a Technique's stereo cabinet. And I channel routed out a few holes so I could run cables and the like. And the whole thing is powered by just a good old power strip. And I don't know if you can see in there, I've got a one of those one spots. And I also have another, just a separate boss uh, pedal power deal. Uh, it's just regular adapter to run the boss pedal. Uh, without it, I was getting a little bit of a hiss and a little bit of noise. So the chain starts at the Polytune, TC Electronics Polytune, and then it goes into a Dunlop Wah pedal. And then we go into the MXR Univibe, and then we're running into a couple of drive pedals. I've got a Ibanez TS9 Tube Screamer, and I've got a three pack of the iStomp by Digitech. And right now I've got a fuzzy pedal loaded, and we've also got a reverb. And then that's running up into our Super Chorus Boss CH1. And I've got that running stereo out to the TC Electronics Flashback. And that is running out stereo again to Digitech iStomp. It's a phaser. And then we're going again stereo to the Boss RC3 Loop Station. It's a super handy pedal for jamming with yourself and uh, just uh, getting better in general. And uh, I've got that running out stereo. I've got one lead going to the Fender Blues Junior 3, which is my new favorite amp. Love just plugging into that straight on with a Fender Strat and going at it to get the closest to a Stevie Ray Vaughan tone with that. The other lead's going out to a Fender Hot Rod Deluxe 3. And uh, both of those in stereo just really make music to my ears. I hope they do to yours as well. So with that, here's a little bit of playing. Hope you guys enjoy it. Mm -hmm. 